Rescue exercise number two, rescuing a panicked, irrational diver at the surface. The first step is to approach and evaluate the diver, asking them to drop their weights and inflate their BCD. Most likely, they will not be responsive, so we put our regulator in and approach the diver. For surface approach, we can go around. This is a lot safer, just takes a little bit more time. Once we go around, try to get a hold of the tank valve and cradle the tank so we can establish positive buoyancy and the panic diver hopefully turns into a tired diver. Second approach. This time we're going to try to grab the diver's opposite wrist. This is also a surface approach. Again, evaluate the diver's state of mind, ask them to establish buoyancy and put in your regulator. Make sure to grab the diver's opposite wrist as this is a performance requirement, spin them around, cradle the tank and establish buoyancy for the diver and yourself. A third approach would be the underwater approach where we put in our regulator and descend. Once underwater we're carefully going to evaluate the diver see if we can locate the weight system and the LPI. Then we're going to go behind the diver, cradle the tank and inflate their BCD and our BCD. Another performance requirement is to use releases to regain control. We assume the panic diver has already grabbed us, so we inflate their BCD, inflate our BCD and push the diver up and away to release ourselves. Another technique is the quick reverse to stay out of the diver's grasp. When we approach the diver we make sure that our feet are sticking slightly forward so when the diver comes for us we can kick backwards and splash water in the diver's face. 